What's happening people, it's James Beardwell here and welcome back to another James Beardwell Away Day vlog. I'm going to be making the short trip to watch Chelmsford City against Eastbourne Borough in the Vanarama South League. I was meant to be going to watch Banston United against Canvey Island but unfortunately their match has been postponed and now this is my second trip to Banston United being postponed. And I've also had one trip being abandoned, which is Romford against AFC Subby when it called off about ten past two, two weeks on two weeks ago on Saturday, and which I couldn't believe that that day. But anyway, I'm really looking forward to make the short trip to watch Chelmsford City against Eastbourne Borough, and I'm now about to be on my way to visit Chelmsford City very shortly. I'm currently now arrived in Chelmsford and I just had my lunch in McDonald's for a quick bite to eat and I'm now just currently on my way to Chelmsford City Football Club to get ready to watch Chelmsford City against Eastbourne Borough in their Vanarama League South and yeah the bus journey went pretty well it only took about 35 minutes to get there and there's no problems on the bus and there's not much traffic which is really really good news and I'm still a little bit disappointed that the Basda United against Canvey Island got called off earlier due to the waterlogged pitch. But that, like I said, it was my second game being postponed on my James Beardwell away days. And that's, that's what it is due to the postponement due to the waterlogged pitch. And I'm, like I said, I'll be doing Chelmsford City against Eastbourne Borough instead of my James Beardwell away days. And I'm just on my way to Chelmsford City Football Club now. And, and I'm really looking forward to the good game. And can this be a fantastic game for the neutrals? I'm now arrived at Chelmsford City Football Club to get ready to watch Chelmsford City against Eastbourne Borough in their Vanarama League South League. I'm really looking forward to this game as a neutral point of view. It's going to be a great game, I reckon. And I think I think Chelmsford City done quite well in the Vanarama League South. And we'll see how today's games see how today's game bring. And the last time I visited visited Chelmsford City, I think it was last year, and also a few years ago when my team Whitton Town played away to Chelmsford City in the. Essex Senior Cup third round. That was when, and that was when Danny Greaves was manager that year for Whitton Town away at Chelmsford City. And that was when Whitton Town went 1-0 up. And then and then Chelmsford City won 3-1 in the second half. And and the final score was 3-1 Chelmsford City that day, and we lost to Chelmsford City. And yeah, I'm just really looking forward to today's game. And like I said, we'll see how today's game bring. And yeah, I'm just really looking forward as a neutral. And can this be a fantastic game for the neutrals? I'm now with a Chelmsford City supporter, Luke. Luke, what is your thoughts on Chelmsford City this season so I mean, far? I mean, so far we've had a bad start to the season. However, in the last few weeks, we've been picking it back up and we've been getting some good performances in. So hopefully we can continue that, continue that on. Yeah, so do you think Chelmsford City will do well in the Vanarama South League? Um, I mean, we, 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 yeah, like I said, we started poorly in the National League South. However, last few months we've been doing well and hopefully we can make a late push for the playoffs. Yeah, so things could be exciting for Chelmsford City. And... So, how long, how long have you been supporting Chelmsford City? So, I've started coming to games since the end of last season and, yeah, I've, I've, I've loved it. It's great down here. Yeah. Thank you so much for your yeah, time and yeah. enjoy the game. Yeah, it's alright, James. Cheers. Thanks. I'm now with another Chelmsford City supporter, John. Hello there, James. Hi, John. And how long have you been supporting Chelmsford City? Probably, how old are you, mate? <laughs> no, quite a while, since 75. <laughs> So, 1875, yeah. so what is your thoughts on Chelmsford City so far this season? Pretty good, uh, come back well in the last six weeks or so, 
Um, hopeful today, they've got a good set of side, they've got a lot more youth, mobility, pace. So yeah, I'm, quite, I'm hoping for three points today. Though. Absolutely, yeah. So do you think like Chelsea City may finish a little bit higher in the league? We're going to attack the seventh place. Uh, whether we'll get it, I don't know, but we'll have a good go at it. Um, it'll keep the season alive anyway, and we're still in the trophy as well. Absolutely, yeah. Thank you so much for your time and enjoy the game. No worries, you do. You enjoy it as well. Thanks. Thanks. Just saved it. Put it in the bar. Save the keeper. Time score: Chelmsford City one, Eastbourne Borough one. And here we got the Chelmsford City City supporter Trevor. Correct. Trevor, what is your thoughts on the first half with Chelmsford City? It was quite a frenetic start. Could have, either side could have had three goals or so. Um, it's a bit worried for a while, but then it settled down and we ended up on top. Could have had a second right at the end there. Fingers crossed for the second half. Or we tend to start second half a bit iffy sometimes, but uh, here we go. Yeah. So what is your thoughts on Chelsea City's season at the moment in the Vanarama South League so far? We haven't quite delivered as we might have done, um, but the season progressing, we're getting better, we're on a good run now, so timing's good, we usually, the last couple of seasons we've done well, the second half of the season, so yeah, confident, optimistic. So how long have you been a, a Chelsea City supporter? Uh, 30 years plus. That's yeah. brilliant. Yeah, long time. Yeah, yeah. 30 years, that's, that's fantastic. <laughs> And do you think Chelsea City would do well, like finishing a little bit higher in the league this season? The way we're going at the moment, yeah, we might just nip into the uh, into the playoffs. Yeah, hopeful. Yeah. Thank you so much for your time. Right, Enjoy the second half. Great to meet you. Great to meet you too. Cheers. Thanks. <laughs> Come on, boys. Edis away day version. Forgot to do the first half one. There has been a goal at the Whitton Town San Marco Stadium. Is it good news or bad news? Unfortunately, it's bad news. It's Whitton Town nil, Haber Swifts one. So far at the moment, it's Whitton Town nil, Haber Swifts one. Just over the bar. Offside, it won't count. Goal being disallowed. There has been another goal at the Whitton Town San Marco Stadium. Unfortunately, it's bad news. It's Whitton Town nil, Haber Swifts two. In the space of 10 minutes later since the first goal of Haber Swifts. So far, it's Whitton Town nil, Haber Swifts two. Corner kick to Chelsea City. Corner to Chelsea City. The Chelsea City fans urging their team on. Oh, just wide. The 
just over the bar. <laughs> that is definitely a booking for kicking the ball away. That is a that is should be absolutely got it right from the referee. The ref got it right. Oh, can this be a late drama? Oh. Oh, straight at the keeper. Keep him in, keep him in. Just over the bar. Oh. oh. The ref just fired away. Brilliant save for the keeper. Call a kick to Chelsea City. Call a kick Chelsea City. Can this be a late drama? Can this be a late drama for Chelsea City? The full time score, Chelmsford City 1, Eastbourne Borough 1. The second half it was still pretty scrappy like it did in the first half. And for the neutral point of view, the game was alright. And and in the other final score at the Whitton Town St. Marco Stadium of Whitton Town nil, Haber Swiss 2. And it wasn't to be Whitton Town's day. And I just hope Whitton Town win it in the next match. And this has been a really good game for both sets of sides, but, but it's very scrappy, but it's a really, really good game. And, but it's been a really, really good day. And I really, really enjoyed my visit at Chelmsford City, and I will definitely come back and visit again one day. Hope you enjoyed today's James Beardwell Away Day vlog. Make sure you subscribe, like, comment down below. I will keep you up to date when I'm going to be doing my next James Beardwell Way Day vlog. And I'm home to go find somewhere a little bit further. But, like I said, in the winter period is very, very difficult because there's been quite a few postponements at the moment. And, like I said earlier, at the very start of my vlog, I was very, very disappointed that the Basda United versus Canvey Island match has been called off earlier due to a waterlogged pitch. But like I said, it was due to the players' safety. But I have really, really enjoyed my visit at Chelmsford City today. And like I said, I will keep you up to date when I'm going to be doing my next James Beardwell Way Day vlog. And I'll see you all later on the next vlog.